Senior Post and Leroy are based in Dumbo, in Brooklyn. At Leroy, we produce commercial and branded content, as well as a slate of original work. Senior Post is exclusively a television and film post house. When COVID-19 hit, Senior Post went from running a 17-suite premier post house to all of us being scattered across the tri-state area. I woke up on a Sunday morning to a text from my boss that said, check your email. I opened up my laptop and the first subject line I see is, this could be big. John Krasinski is making a Some Good News show. Do you want to be involved? When the sequence came to us, it was mostly laid out, but we made a couple choices to try to make it a little bit more compelling and relatable to everyone. It was just supposed to be one thing, something to make people smile. And so we just sat down and, and put it together in about 18 hours, and then it went online. I'm John Krasinski, and if it isn't clear yet, I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Waking up the morning after the first episode and see it number one trending on YouTube, that was when it got pretty surreal. I knew it was really big when my grandma texted me and told me that she watched it and loved it. It really made me understand how much people were responding to something that was going to brighten their day. I think the reason that we were a good fit with John and his team was because we understood that it was supposed to be a very genuine, heartfelt show. Amanda! Oh my God! From the first week of SGN, the reason that was able to work is that my core team at Senior Post and Leroy works really well together. Whether we're in the office or we're at home, there's a shorthand, there's an infrastructure, there's a process and a role sort. We've got the two EPs on the Leroy side, which is Evan Wolf, Bucksbaum, and myself. Joanna Noggle is the supervising editor of everything that we do. So she sets the tone, the style, and the look and feel. And all that's supported by Liz Stallmeyer, our amazing head of post, who after the first week created a process that allowed us to stack the team quickly without a lot of onboarding. Now the back end of all of this is Crush, our online editor. It's really him that enables us to be able to produce at such a high level while we're home. And so what we were able to do was use the core team as the nucleus of, of how SGM was made and really add on to it as the show grew. We are not only receiving assets from Zoom, iPhone, Android, but we're ripping assets from Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. We really needed to have a program that could adapt to the constant changes that were happening throughout this. There was no doubt in my mind that Adobe Premiere was the right choice. The fact that Premiere allows you to work with so many formats cuts down everything for this project by about half. Episode one, we had 80 videos. By the later episodes, you were really working with closer to 200 assets. Back to you, John. Thanks, Austin. My favorite segment had to be the NASA segment. One of the astronauts said, one of my favorite quotes from the whole entire series, which was, an Earth in crisis is still an Earth worth returning to. Also seeing Oprah was pretty cool. <laughs> Every single thing about SGN is altruistic. It's about bringing happiness and joy and good news when that's really hard to find. Things don't have to be complicated to be good. Things don't have to be slick and polished and put together to be impactful. So you can add bells, you can add whistles, but at the end of the day, if you're not telling a story that's worth hearing, there's no point.